your Storm Team 18 forecast. Weather from where you live. All right, we can see the pinwheel, everything going up and around the hot ridge. Again, 100s here and everything moves up and around. And we get these ridge riders that ride up and over the, uh, the dome of heat, if you will. Um, what we're, we're looking for tonight, though, is one of these to form out towards Nebraska and Iowa, northwest Illinois. Something develops here, kind of outside of the thickest smoke and dust, forms here and then moves kind of southeastward. And then tomorrow morning through midday, it impacts part of our area, mainly the southwestern half the way it looks right now. Now it may be weakening as it comes into our area because we're going to our capping will be increasing. It's like a lid. It's putting a damper on those storms trying to tower and go up, but it still may may maintain enough strength to bring about the risk of a, a few isolated strong to severe gusts. So you know, once we get past seven o'clock in the morning and then right up through mid late morning, midday, that's when this would kind of go through our area. There you see the lows at 68 to 73. For tonight and there is the risk of uh, those weakening storms and again isolated strong to severe gusts right in this time uh, time frame and then it turns partly cloudy in the afternoon and into the evening. We've got highs 87 to 93 with still that dusty smoky haze and any rain we get may have a little ash or a little mud mixed in it or part of the area 90 at Monticello eventually. Uh, low 90s Winnemac will be around 88 at Frankfurt and 90 at Attica. Remember those heat indices at the very end of the day, mid 90s to about 107. And kind of a similar situation Thursday, right? Now it's kind of the southwest, about two thirds of the area. They have the best shot of getting a weakening little complex of storms. Again, isolated, strong to severe gust can't be ruled out. And then it's hazy in the afternoon with 91. Your highs upper 80s to low 90s. Those heat indices late in the day, mid 90s to as high as 107. So here we go. Watch the clock here. There's four o'clock in the morning. Once we get past seven and through 10, nine, uh, 10, 11, noon, here comes that little complex right here. Again, it's mainly the southwest half of the area, Fowler, Lafayette, Frankfurt area and southwestward. And then we're dry and then we watch Thursday morning and this one's a little farther north. This model wants to bring it in for everybody, but I think you know, the southwest two thirds, Kokomo, Monticello to Morocco in southwestward. This will go through as well. Some scattered shower storms Friday. It's a dry weekend, but very warm. Hot upper ridge re-strengthened, so it's looking very hot next week. And eventually you got this little ridge rider on the periphery, that heat going here, but a little cold front will come through and eventually it cools off a little bit at the end of next week. So 86 on Saturday, 87 on Sunday, still some smoke issues here and it's still going to be a little bit humid and then it's hot, humid Tuesday at 91. We're in the 90s Wednesday, Thursday, and then we watch for at least a few storms next Friday. It doesn't look like a big blockbuster rain or anything widespread, but a few storms and turning cooler with 80s.